हेलो एवरीवन सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट अनदर टॉपिक ऑन द टोपो शीट दैट इज बेरिंग आई थिंक नाउ डेज बोर्ड मे नॉट आस्क दीज टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चंस बिकॉज वी हैव टू ड्रॉ लोड्स ऑफ लाइन ऑन द मैप फॉर कैलकुलेटिंग बेरिंग बट स्टिल वी नीड टू कवर दिस टॉपिक सो बिफोर अंडरस्टैंडिंग बेरिंग वी नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड अ सिंपल फैक्ट that whenever we see anything so any map uh, we need to draw these lines so always that uh, top is at the north and right hand side that is east and bottom side that is south and left hand side it is always west so north that comes always on the 0 degree then east that comes on the 90 degree south that comes on the 180 degree and uh, west that comes on a Uh, 270 degree and then again we need to measure the bearing a just clockwise direction we need to measure it just clockwise direction and we move uh, 360 degree so as we can see we need to move clockwise so again if we come clockwise uh, on the north so that is 360 degree so uh, there are two type of questions they will ask first is called forward bearing and second is called the backward bearing so let's uh, discuss what is that forward bearing when they will say you that you need to check the bearing like you are standing on the point a and point b is a tree so you need to check angle from point a of point b that is called the forward bearing and backward bearing when you need to check a angle by standing on point b but you need to check uh, angle to point a so that is called the backward bearing that means you are standing there from object to uh, where you are standing on the point a you need to calculate the angle so how to calculate the angle let's start with that first of all as you can see there is point a so on the point a you need to draw a perpendicular so let's do that so i have drawn a perpendicular we'll write here north so again we need to do the same on the point b also now second step what we need to take that uh, just join point a with point b let's do that so now what you need to do that you should be very careful while keeping your protector always you need to keep the zero of the protector on the north line like we can see north line is here so we need to keep our protector exactly here on the north so here you can see the north is on the zero degree so now i need to check the angle so if i'll move further clockwise direction so i'll see here it is uh, 75 76 77 so the angle here is 77 degree so that is called the forward bearing but let's say we need to calculate angle of from object where we are standing so how to calculate that angle so while calculating that angle we should be very careful as i told you in the beginning we need to calculate the angle always clockwise so here also we need to move always clockwise so how we are calculating the angle here i told you that this part if we move full clockwise that cover 180 degree so here you can see that if i'll keep my protector here here i'll write north if i'll keep my protector here so you can find i need to move full clockwise direction so here it comes 180 degree already so then what i need to do i need to move my protector now if i'll check angle of angle of a so that is here 70 75 76 77 78 so here comes the angle 78 degree so here what we need to do we need to add both the angles 
180 degree plus 78 degree so that comes that comes 258 degree angle so always what we need to keep in mind while calculating bearing that this angle should be always clockwise hope you understood the simple topic of bearing just while calculating you need to be little careful what uh, actual direction you need to keep your protector or uh, how exactly you need to keep your protector and how to find out the bearing angle hope you like this video thank you